Dear students, welcome to the course on Information and Communication Technology for Libraries. I am Dr. Usha Mujamunshi, librarian at Indian Institute of Public Administration and also course coordinator for this course. At the outside, I thank you for enrolling for this course. We hope that you have a great learning experience during the course. The objective of the course is to impart in-depth knowledge on use of information and communication technology in libraries and to prepare students either to work in a fully automated library that subscribes to resources in print as well as in electronic format or to set up a modern library on their own. The course imparts in-depth knowledge on basic concept and scope of ICT, its associated technologies and their evolution, it deals with functional units of computers in computer software, including operating system, system software, and application software that covers word processing, spreadsheet, and database management system. The course also elaborates on various contemporary programming languages and their levels. It elaborates upon computer networks, their types, topologies, switching techniques, media and devices, network standards and protocols. Data networks and digital technologies that are used for developing integrated services such as ISDN, ATM, DSL, etc. are dealt in with in details. It touches upon security and software and hardware solutions available for it. The course elaborates on internet, its evolution, protocol, services and internet search engines. It imparts knowledge on Web 2.0 tools and techniques that can be used to create a collaborative and participative environment among its users and library on semantic web and process of delivering high-level services using semantic properties of information. During the course, you will learn about library automation, integrated library management software packages, and its functional modules, including acquisition, cataloging, circulation, serials control, and OPEC. It also elaborates on retroconversion of bibliographic records and use of RFID in libraries. The course touches upon open source library software and Mark and Dublin Quark as standard for bibliographic information. It discusses Inflipnet and Delnet as two important library networks in India and also Janet and OCLC as important lab library networks in UK and USA respectively. Library consortia, its history, growth and development, needs, benefits, types, pricing models and important services and activities are dealt in detail. The course elaborates on UGC InfoNet Digital Library Consortium, INDIST AICTE Consortium, and Ishod Sindhu as important library consortium in India. Lastly, this course touches upon concept of open data, crowdsourcing, cloud computing, and ethics in cyberspace. Students, this course is designed for the students of library and information science as well as for professionals working in library and information centers. However, Anyone who wishes to learn about ICT for libraries is welcome to join the course. The course consists of 15 parts that are delivered in a time span of 15 weeks. During these 15 weeks, experts will be interacting with you through discussion forum, live chats, and emails. You will also have an opportunity to interact with your co-learners who have also joined this course through discussion forum and live chats. We'll talk about in detail with you that what is going to be covered in these 15 weeks for the 15 parts that I just spoke a while ago. 